Okay, problem number 17 in section 2.3, and this one is on page 86. It says a manufacturer has monthly fixed costs of $40,000 and a production cost of $8 for each unit produced. The product sells for $12 a unit. Okay, so ultimately they want to um, build a profit function and then compute um, the profit for different um, production levels. So first of all, remember, one thing we can kind of um, build towards is a model. Profit um, is revenue subtract cost. And uh, we'll go with very simple models here. What is the cost function? Well, the cost function is um, based on how many units are produced. Um, the cost is $8 per unit, and then there's a fixed or upfront cost of $40,000. So that's a simple linear relationship between um, the number of units and the cost to produce them. Um, B wants the revenue. They tell us they sell for $12 per unit, so if they produce and sell X units, the revenue would just simply be 12 times um, X, $12 per unit. And then the profit um, would be the revenue subtract the cost. When profit is positive, that's good. When profit is negative, that's a loss. So our profit function would be um, 12X subtract. Now be careful here. Um, you're subtracting the cost function. The cost function has two terms in it, so I've got to be careful to make sure that I get grouping symbols there. Now, uh, my profit function then will be uh, 12x minus 8x, and then subtract 40,000. Or my profit function, simplifying that, would be 4x minus. 40,000. And then finally, D, uh, compute the profit or loss corresponding productions le production levels of 8,000 and 12,000. So the production level for 8,000, I would evaluate my profit function at 8,000. Oh, and I would have a negative 8,000, so a loss of $8,000 would be the outcome of that. And then if I produce 12,000 units and sold, we're assuming we sell these two, um, then we'd have... case I get a positive 8,000, which is better. So I have a profit of $8,000 in this case. So a very simple relationship of three functions there. Um, cost usually um, would require a um, knowing a fixed cost and amount. A lot of times in getting everything set up and all the other things are get involved in producing the items. And then there's the variable cost, the cost per item. Revenue is basically how many you sell and uh, how much you make on each one, or how much you sell them for, I mean. And then profit is the uh, the total revenue, subtract the total cost. So algebraically, we can build those functions and combine them to get profit, and then uh, do some calculations.